everyone we're going to show you how we use the everyday amazing collection so in this collection you get yourself a perfect foundation a perfect concealer of your choice you will get yourself an eyeshadow we are going to go with a la vida mocha and i will show you why i choose this color we also get a blush a bronzer or a powder you can choose one of these i would advise a translucent powder because that will set your makeup in place and we can use everything else you get a perfect eye liner amazing you get a perfect mascara as well which is our one step fiber mascara you get yourself a lovely lip gloss i have chosen a smile you get yourself a perfect lipstick which this one is number 102 yes it's amazing you also get yourself a lovely lip liner which this one is number three a festive pink how do we do a look with this well quite easy i would team up the uh, primer and setting spray which doesn't come into the collection but i can't be dealing without my primer so we're gonna go in and we're gonna use our eyeshadow first so we're going to use our eyeshadow first, which is La Vida Mocha. So we're going to use La Vida Mocha first. I need to get to my mirror, which I'm not sure where I've put it. There we go. So we're going to get our mirror. We're going to go in with La Vida Mocha. And we're going to do ourselves some brows. So there we go, we've got our outline of our brows. The reason why we are going in with a mono brow technique is for symmetry. So we do this for symmetry. As you can see, I'm kind of really concentrating on these brows because I do find it quite hard to do the brows. But we are going in with them. Give it some time and it all comes together. If you just take your time doing it, look at that. <laughs> and we're going to show you how to carve them as well. So there we go, look at that, we're just going to carve them up. You know, at the moment, two completely different shapes because we built this one up more already because I always build that one up first because I always find that one harder to do. There is always one that you find harder to do. I don't know if everyone feels the same like that. You can uh, drop me down your views in the comments. There we go, look at that. So this is why we have gone with La Vida Mocha. Now I can basically colour match you to your brows and to your eyeshadow colours. And there we go. And what we're going to do next is we are going to carve these brows out and we're going to use our concealer. Now I have chosen concealer zero and that is what I'm using concealer zero because this will carve your brows out nicely and it will lighten and brighten your brows. Which I will show you. Look at that. See, look how that has just lightened and brightened my brows already. How amazing is that? So it's just going down into the other side. There we go. Lightened and brightened brows. So we're also going to pop a little bit onto the eyelids. 
because this will give us a nice base to work with. Now you can do a few different things for this look. You can basically use your lipstick to do all over the eyeshadow as an eyeshadow look and it will be like a creamy eyeshadow and it's going to be very effective. So we are using just all of the Everyday Amazing Collection products. So what you can do is you can pop on your eyeshadow. You can use that for your brows. You can use it for your contour ring. And you can use your lipstick since it's like such a pretty colour. You can literally just get this in here. And just go dab, 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 dab. Get yourself some nice colour going on. You can accent it into the corners. And have yourself like a bit of colour going on in the corners. Everyone's like, why is she using lipstick on her eyes? Well, it is very effective. And we are going to try something different. Something that I've not actually tried before. So we're going to try it. And we're going to see how it goes. So there we go. See, we have got our lovely pinkness there. What we're going to do is we're going to give it a little blend around. So it just sort of looks gorgeous. So we've gone higher on this side. Oops. But it's okay. What we're going to do is we're going to blend it around. And we're going to pop a little bit onto the top of the other side as well. Just blend all that in nicely. Look at that. See, that's gave you just this like pretty sort of like neon-y sort of colour. You can use your La Vida Mocha if you wanted to as your eyeshadow as well. If you wanted to go for a more natural look. But I like to go with a bright look. So I'm going with the lipstick look on the eyes. It still looks slightly darker on this side. So we're just going to pop a little bit more on there. There we go, just like that. So there we go, look at that. Boom, 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 easy, nice. There we go. So now we're going to try something different. We're going to go in with Smile. Don't know how this is going to go because I've never done it before. But this has got some pigment to it. It's going to be just as pink. But we're just going to do it over like a little accent of a colour. Just to give it two different colour shades of a definition. And it also gives it a little bit of a shine. There we go, look at that. What do we think? Do we think it's pretty? It's so pretty. So what we're gonna do now is we are gonna go in with our foundation. So we're just gonna go a little swell, a little swell. We don't need to put on an awful lot of foundation because this is 50% pigmented. It is a botanical foundation. It has no harsh chemicals inside. So it will not sink into your pores. So it's going to leave your skin nice. So what we're going to do is we're going to carve it around the brow a little bit. And we're just going to wait for it to warm up. And then we're going to swirl it around. There we go. So we're just swirling it around just like that. I think I still have some glue when I had my lashes on last. It's okay. There we go. Look at that. Look at that side. Look how amazing it is. You don't need to put on hardly any product whatsoever. Oh my God. That is so good. Right. So we're just going to swirl it around a little bit more. And then we're just going to go onto this side. I'll pop a little bit on. As you can see, we don't need hardly any product at all. So we just wait for it to warm up a little bit because once it warms up on the skin, we're going to carve the brow. I know we're going to give it a little swell. See how that is covered up everywhere. That has got amazing coverage everywhere. Look at that. 
Look how amazing that coverage is. There we go, look at that. And now you're looking at that and you're thinking, what about that brow? What's going on with that brow? So we're going to get our concealer brush. We're just going to go like this with our brush. And there we go, look at that. We're just going to tidy up these brows. But look how easy that just like blended away. And you're looking at it and you're thinking, wow, there's still like a bit of a thing there. So what we're going to do is we're going to get the buffer brush. And we're just going to buff that right out. We're going to blend all this in nicely and buff that right out. Look at that. And if you want to, you can add yourself a little dab of concealer onto it. So we're just going to go a little swirl. Just one tiny little swirl. That's all it takes. And then just a little bit. So there you go. You can have give yourself a little bit of extra there. It will also give yourself a little highlight up here. You can give yourself a little highlight on the nose. So what we're going to do now is we're going to use the buffer brush. We're going to get our concealer zero. And we're just going to go... We're only going to put a tiny bit of concealer underneath because we don't need a lot of concealer. You do not want to put a lot of concealer underneath your eyes. You don't want to make it all heavy. You don't want to be pulling your eyes. You don't want anything on there because it's just going to look... There you go. Look at that. Look how that has just lightened and brightened my face. It's like, whoa, hello. Who is that there? <laughs> so we just lightened and brightened the face. Now what we're going to do now is we are going to go in with our perfect eyeliner. So you get this in your everyday amazing bundle. So you get your perfect eyeliner and we're just going to literally go. And that was created with one sweep across. And then you can just build it up. There you go, look at that. Look how that just gave you such a sharp eyeliner. I'll just build the line up in the corner there a little bit. There we go, look at that. Look at that perfection. We can give ourselves a little wing as well. And you just sort of colour it in. And then just connect it up. There you go, see that? And look at that nice little flick there. That just accents your eyes. Look at that. I am so amazed by that by myself. And I could never do wings before. So we're going to go with the other side. So we just do our usual sweep across. And then we build it up because as you can see you can do a super fine line to a super thick line so this is very versatile to use look how easy and amazing this perfect eyeliner is to use so we're just going to tidy up that little bit in the corner there Because everything is fixable. Now we need to match up these wings. So. There we go. And now we just colour it in. And we got ourselves some lovely wings. They are not completely straight, but it's okay. And there we go. We just tidy it up a little bit, but look at that amazing wings. I am very happy with my wings. So now what we can do now underneath, 
we can give ourselves another little accent because this is our lip liner and I'm going to give us another little accent underneath and I've never done this before either but I'm going to do it anyway I'm using the lip liner as eyeliner how awesome is that You don't have to use it as eyeliner, but I thought I'd give it a try. And it's actually quite effective. Look how that has just popped up them eyes. It's just made them eyes just go pink, pink, <laughs> pink. So it's just pinged them up. So now you're thinking, All right, okay, so we need, we need some bronzering going on. Okay, so I'm just going to go with my bronzer brush. I'm going to go in with that La Vida Mucha, which is... You're like looking at it, you're thinking, right, that's that's quite dark. Look at that. Because we've gone with dark brows, so we've gone dark. But it's okay, because guess what? We can blend this out. And it does look like a little bit of a darker bronzer, but it's okay, because we'll just mix it up. We'll blend it through. And it will be fine. As I said, I can colour match you to your actual color look at that see how that has just blended through and now that just looks like a nice contour so we're just going to blend the other side we're going to swirl it around and there you go look at that look at that so we're just going to pop a little bit across the top Across the top of the head, windscreen wiper action, windscreen wiper action. Pop a little bit underneath. Look at that. You can, as I said, you can go for lighter colours, but it's, I'm liking it. I am liking a dark contour. look at that and what we're going to do now is we're going to pop a little bit of that concealer zero down the nose because we're going to give it just that little extra edge we're going to lighten it we're going to highlight and we're going to blend it all through a little bit there we go look at that oh this is looking good so now we're thinking right okay well i'd quite like a bit of blush so you go back with your uh, trusty lipstick and you just go do a few little dots on the face there we go look at that and dot 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 oh why have you done this that doesn't look like blush at all so let's go and blend it Now we're blending it up at an angle and then downwards. Look at that. Look how that has just made a nice blush. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. It's so pretty. She's just sweeping it upwards and blending it down. There you go. If you want to give yourself an extra little bit of pinkness, we can use the buffer brush. And we can swirl that around a little bit. And if you want to give yourself an extra bit of pink, you're like, right, okay, that's not pink enough. You can add a little bit more. Let's add some more. So we add some more in and we just go swirly, 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 swirly. But as you can see, I am still blending it downwards. And that gives you just a nice blush colour. And you're like, oh, I like this. This is quite good. So now you're happy with everything that is there. You're going to go in with your perfect press powder, which we call our Snapchat filter. 
in the, as you can see I am hit and pan and why am I hit and pan because I love it so much I use it all the time so now we're just going to go around and dab it all in and we're going to set our makeup into place I'm not sweeping it around I'm dabbing it on my face you don't want to sweep it around you want to dab it so you dab 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 and that's just blending everything nicely together it's setting your makeup Look at that. Look at that. Perfection is perfection. Right, so now we're going to go with our perfect mascara. And we're going to do our lashes. So let's go in with our perfect mascara. There we go. This is coat number one. So we're going to go with the other side. We're going to tidy up where it went up there. <laughs> so we're going to go down into the bottom now as well. There we go, and on to the other side. There we go, see now that has made game changer. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go in with our perfect lip liner and we're going to actually use it on the lips. There you go, look at that. This is smudge proof and waterproof, so it's gonna keep you it's gonna stay on here all day because it's enduring. And look how super quick and easy I just lined my lips. Oh my God, that was so easy to do. So now we're gonna go in with our perfect lipstick. We don't have to go in with our perfect lipstick. We could just use the lip gloss, but I'm gonna use the perfect lipstick first. This also teams up as a moisturiser. Yep, it teams up as a moisturiser. So we're going to go with coat number two on the lashes. There we go, look at that. Just separating our lashes nicely there. Also giving them a nice lift and a boost. Look at that. You can't really see. You can sort of see. I'm loving my wings though. Now you can build these layers up because these are completely buildable. So you can build the layers up, right? And every single time I do my mascara, as you probably notice, it is on my nose. There we go, and now it's gone. So look at it, the look so far. It's like, oh yes, look at this. So no look is complete without our little lip gloss. So we're gonna go with our smile or lip gloss because we're gonna smile. Now, this has a pink pigment in it, as you can see. Pop in. Let's pop a little more. Let's get a little bit more in there. Oh, who's a pretty little pink princess? <laughs> there we go, look at this. So this is our everyday amazing collection and 
look at the look we have just created and we have created this look in less than half an hour amazing so not only does it save you time it also saves you money and we also donate to the brighter together foundation so we are donating to an awesome charity as well so how can you argue with that i'm just looking at that and thinking my eyeliner is actually bigger on this side than this side so i may need to, may want to fix that i may want to fix that just just quickly um, if I can find where I've put the eyeliner. It's like we've done this so quick. You could do this so much quicker than I did because um, when you're not talking all the time. Yeah, when you're not talking all the time, it will be much better. That is better, isn't it? I don't know why I went with such a thick line on that side, but I had to match it up. <laughs> right, so there we go. This is our look, right? I'm going to go and sit and forget my face. This is not available in the collection. But I can't go anywhere without my set and spray. I love it. So this is my look. Thank you all for watching. If you want to hit the subscribe button, we do lots of different tutorials all the time. Thank you all so much for watching. Bye.